So like the other day, Dan, that's this new guy I met on Tinder. Dan invited me over to watch the rugby. So then I was like, okay. But then I was like, oh shit, I hate rugby, but I didn't tell him that. Then I realized like maybe I don't hate rugby. I just don't connect with rugby. So now, so now I've invited these two majorly famous rugby oaks over, Victor Matfield and Bucky Sporter. And um, welcome, welcome, guys. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I want to know is what actually is rugby? Rugby is a game of oaks and the ball, and you must get that ball across a line by running bloody fast and getting that ball to the other side to get points. But team of the most points wins. Whatever, that sounds just like soccer. <clears throat> no, like it's basically exactly the same. You said get the ball forward by running and then scoring points. And that is soccer. I know because my last boyfriend was like really into soccer. But there are <laughs> one major difference between rugby and soccer. In rugby, you can moor oaks and oaks can moor you. And we don't go crying about it. More oaks! Okay, you don't have to get all emo about it, okay? What I actually want to know is more to do with... There's you... another difference. Our balls. <gasps> OMG! Did you just say balls? We have different balls. Okay, so remember in the movie Invictus, Madiba was all about like using rugby to bring the country together? Mm. Uh, yeah. Mm? Yeah, so so like what's happening with that? Like what's rugby doing for national unity now? I mean, do you feel like it's still acting as a force to bring us together and stuff, huh? Um, mm. Sure, uh, that's a tricky one. Uh, can I get back to you on that one? Yeah, okay. And that's all we have time for, folks. Join me next time on Rugby with Dummies where I ask more questions and maybe even get some answers I understand.